Too late. You already went live. <laughs> well, here we go. Wait, we can hurry up. Amanda. There. There we go. <laughs> Delayed. I see it. I see it on the page. I see it. Ooh. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> hello, yeah. hello. We are Hi. going. I see it on the page. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of The Geekly Show here on our Facebook page. We come to you live every Tuesday at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. And we are down to Geekly today because she's on vacation. She said, forget uh-huh. y'all. I'm going on vacation. Uh, but yeah. I'm sure she's going to pop in. <laughs> Hopefully. I don't know how long her flight is. She may still be in the air, but Mm -hmm. Tanya is off enjoying her vacation with her family, and we desperately miss her. But we're going to talk shows today, which is so exciting. We haven't talked about TV shows and binge-watching shows in a while. So our theme for today's show is to give you guys some shows you should probably binge for the summer. So before we get going on that, let's do some quick introductions. So hello, everybody. My name is Amira Martin, and I'm from 4 Hi, everyone. It's Sarah from sarahscoop.com. It's Amanda from Guide for Geeks, Guide for Moms, Crazy Amanda Rex. Just hit 5,000 subscribers on YouTube. Thank you very much. (laughs) (laughs) And hi, Tina and Rachel. I'm Mama's Geeky. (laughs) Oh, she cut me off. Nobody oh, cares. She did. Re-enter. No. Re-enter. I am Tessa with Mama's Geeky <laughs> You didn't sound very excited with that one, Tessa. Is it hard to follow me? Is it hard to follow me? Well, I mean, first of all, you two are wearing these ears. Just <laughs> yeah. rub it in their face. They are. I, they know full. I feel it. Full like wear. Them. We all got a lovely package. Thank you, Disney. I shouldn't be upset. We got a lovely package from from them about Dumbo, but somebody yeah. in the group didn't get any ears. That same person collects <laughs> ears. We don't know that. Well, I didn't right. open mine yet. Oh, that's you're getting good. well. You're getting Tessa. so angry. I saved mine. Oh, so we can, I can open it <laughs> and we can show everybody what we all got in our cute little packages. Tanya got one too. I think she. Showed her on her ears. Instagram stories. Yeah, okay. Yes, she did get ears. I know. Uh, uh, maybe oh, did, did, did Amira get so ears? Many. Did Amira get ears? Did she Amira get ears? ears. <laughs> She's not show us. Why does... So, first of all, everyone, Dumbo is, is out on, I'm gonna cry. on Blu-ray. And so is Cinderella. So, today we are celebrating Dumbo. Live action Dumbo, by the way. And the classic Cinderella, because they're out. <laughs> yeah. um, and I did get ears. I'm Why sorry. Did I oh! Put them on, Amira. Put them on. Put them on. Put them on. <laughs> but I'm really excited because my daughter and I collect ears. This is what we do. Every time we go to Disney, that's our tradition. We pick out new pairs of ears. So well, I've got to put them on. Well, maybe Tessa brags about how she has all the ears and collects them. Maybe they already I, thought you had these ears. Well, Tessa, maybe I don't think she's got an ear. <laughs> Tessa's going to cry. Tessa. I am going to cry because they're super cute and I want them real Tessa, bad. don't cry. And we also, but you got the Alex and Ani. I saw that. Yes. I did. Did, that. did y'all yeah, see this? I did. That. This is so. I collect those too. So and did y'all see what it says one. on there? A dream is a wish your heart makes. Yeah. Oh my god! They are they all the same? Yeah. Yeah, Aww. I think we all got the same ones. I'm trying to pull mine out so I can see. And isn't Alex yep. and we Annie? All got the same ones. Ain't they? I the... did get these cool shades. <laughs> those. I love that. So that's Cinderella. Yes, I. We got the cool shades. Mm-hmm. So the shades, and it looks like a t-shirt. We got a t-shirt too, y'all. A Cinderella yep. t-shirt. We so Cinderella isn't this t-shirt. the fancy jewelry place? This the fancy jewelry place, right? Yes. Yeah, fancy, fancy. fancy. I know. I got a lot of those. Those are nice. I like got some, I, they have some really good for... Star Wars ones. Tessa, you I can have. have my my journal. 
You mean your autograph book? It's an autograph book. Oh, this is, this you is can, your, your notebook. Oh, your you notebook. can have that away, Beyonce. <laughs> you might be needing to sign it. Oh, that's true. I should. I, I should do bring... like this journal a lot. Actually. For Bollywood. Yeah, I like this one. This is really cute. It is. I love a good uh, journal. I go through journals. Oh, I lot, do too. So. You know, they say people should journal every single day. Do I, I do. I, I do. I journal every single morning. And we got, oh, I look, this is my start. favorite thing. Like we got a luggage tag. tag. We I got know. a luggage tag. I know. <laughs> I'm excited about That's this. your favorite thing? Then you don't need your ears, Amanda. <laughs> oh, oh, my excited. gosh. Salty Tessa. <laughs> I am so salty. <laughs> Thank you, Disney, for sending Thank us you. this wonderful bag. Yes. You. Also, Disney, oh. if you have a spare Sorry. pair of ears, please send it to Tessa. Have a pouting. Because I will pout every day. And we oh did. My so it's on. And we will tease her mercilessly because yeah. that's what the Geeklies do to one another. They so will. They're going to all on. be on Marco Polo with yep. their ears. So yep. you yep. need to. The bag itself is like really I cute. Know. It's really cute. I know. I this love is it. perfect yeah. for the mm -hmm. summer. Like this is a good summer tote. That's exactly what I was thinking. This is perfect because we, we live like two houses down from the park and we go there and we eat lunch yeah. there a lot. And this is like. Perfect bag for me well, to take see, stuff down. You Aww. don't need ears. You don't need ears. You got your bag. I need ears. You got, you got a tote for lunch. What else do you need? Ears but, and a we, luggage tag. We also and a luggage tag. We also though got the movies on digital copy, which right yeah, now I said, kids, go watch Dumbo, <laughs> and don't bother me oh, while we go gosh. live on Geekly Show. So they're watching Dumbo right now, but it's on Blu-ray, Cinderella on Blu-ray. And Dumbo on Blu-ray and both digital today. So that's what they're doing. Yes. So fun. <laughs> Tina's so rubbing it in me. too. Tina. I can't see Tina in the comments. Tina is what You saying. can't see? I can see. They're right there. Well, she I said, those okay. ears look I'm gorgeous. Phone, look. Oh, Don't they yeah. look? They have the little castle uh, on there. Oh, okay. that's Tina. Ah. <laughs> These Thank are probably, you, Tina. yes, look how they spark. <laughs> okay, all right, right, fine, fine, fine. I, I will be a team player. I'll take mine off for now. Oh, Mira loves me. I'm I not. do. You know I love you. <laughs> I know. So I'll take them off for now. But they are Anna's going never in my She just hair. doesn't want to ruin her hair. <laughs> I don't. That's true. <laughs> I did. I fluffed it just right for the show. So See? I got to keep it fluffed. But, but today we're talking TV shows, which is yes. so exciting because mm. I feel like we used to talk about TV shows all the time, and, um, you know, we influence each other to watch different shows, which has been nice mm -hmm. to kind of trust one another here on the Geekly Show and Geekly's in our little circle and say, no, girl, you need to watch this show. Mm -hmm. So today we're doing a full episode of What You Watching, yes. and we're going to share all of our wonderful things that we have watched so far and things that we're watching currently and shows that we know y'all need to be watching this summer. So I'm really excited about that. And I want to start, I'm starting with Sarah because Sarah keeps talking about Handmaid's Tale and I'm going to need her to convince me. Okay, Amir, you're, you're starting with the wrong person. I've oh. been not watching TV. You just watched <laughs> Handmaid's Tale. No, you? I'm almost caught up. I'm not even caught up. But Amanda convinced me that I need to keep watching Ugh. it. Well, so, Sarah, you I'm are on season three though, right? Yeah, you're the on latest season? one on Hulu. Isn't that three? Yeah, yeah, yeah that's yeah. three. I'm on season three. And how many so have like, you watched? Okay, I'm at the part where she's talking to her husband on the phone. They're having him call. They're having her call him to meet. Oh, you almost caught up. You almost caught up. It's, okay, that's where I'm at. And I didn't <laughs> get to finish that episode. So I don't know if he met her at the airport or not. But I don't understand how y'all watch that show. Me, how do you watch that show? Me and Sarah, though. I, we, I don't think I could watch it. We were on the same That's page. That's what I said. That's <laughs> what I said. We were on the same page about this season, though, right, Sarah? Because when it first, yeah. I was all excited when it, when it was first coming. I was like, oh, Handmaid's Tale's coming back in June and June. We both were all excited about it, right? And then it's, wait. And then it started, and Sarah was like, are you watching this? I was like, yeah. <laughs> she was like, I can't get into it. I was like, I said, Sarah, this is what you got to do. Just put it on the first couple episodes. Just put it on. Have it playing in the background. Watch it a little bit. Because those first few are just, eh. But then it starts getting better. And you see, it's starting to get better because, and yeah, things are starting to happen. So this season, but first season's the best. First season, y'all. First season, I know. I, yeah, I know it brings some feelings. I know it brings some feelings, but why y'all making faces? 
I don't, I don't think listen, I could, uh. you guys, I was the same way. I was like, I'll never watch that disgusting show. Like it is so <laughs> messed up. Then you watch it and you're like, it is messed up, but what's going to happen? What's going to happen? Uh, uh, I yeah, don't know. and that's the I thing. So Rachel, and I like first, a good messed up show. But the this first seems season, like it's though, little... it's like you they they hook you on the ends, like the endings. They do. They keep mm. you watching it because you want to see what happens next. And Rachel makes a oh. good point because it it's based off a book. I read the book. Mm-hmm. I seen the first. They had a first movie about this. Have you ever seen the first movie, Rachel? Because the first movie. It's pretty much like the book, but it ends kind of where the first season ends, the the first movie. So then when they started going, now they're going like off the book. And now I think, I, th- I think you're so right. So this part, this season is not related to the book. No. I need to read it because mm-hmm. I love reading them and then seeing them. Oh yeah, But me I didn't too. even realize it was a book. But the book is just as hardcore. <laughs> the book is yeah. just as hardcore. I can't do it. Can't do it. Because they got the no. scene. Y'all know what it's about, right? Yes. Yeah, we've talked about it a couple of times, and yeah, right? I don't. I just ugh. and they I only have so many people in the and the women are, are fertile. There's only so many people. Are, I that, got too many other things I gotta mm. watch. That too many other things. And then they look. have yeah, Abby's one. They I have these whole rituals. Like, oh yeah, my son. Oh wait, what, did, Ray Rachel what say? Did you say Amanda? My what husband says it's been. It's a show. Oh, just this. <laughs> A show of Elizabeth Moss's face. <laughs> That's what it feels like every time I see somebody talking about it or I see a clip. I'm like, oh, there she is again. Yeah. But it's, I can't. This every after every see every episode, even it seems like I go on social media and everybody's so upset. So I'm like, why yeah. don't you watch the show that just upsets you every episode? I, but I don't you should look that. at it as they're getting invested in the show. Yeah. Oh my gosh, oh. it just. I it mean, the so hardest awesome. part, don't you think, Sarah, is like the rituals they have to get pregnant because they bring these mm-hmm. handmaids mm-hmm. into the when thing. they hold. Oh, her yeah, down. You were talking oh. about that last week or the week the before, part. and I was like, uh, uh-uh. uh. They got I this. No, they got You're the not rituals. Me. Uh, I know that part's terrible. Like it's hard to watch. I mean, and what happened yeah. to... So why do well, I want to watch it? I know. Maybe, why you, maybe this somebody this else isn't helping. Maybe someone else that's watching, or Amanda, you know. What happened to the guy that became the dad of Nicole? The one that was the guy that lived at the house. Oh, yeah. His name. The driver? Where did he go? The driver? Yeah, the I don't driver. know where the driver where is. is. I don't know where he is. They haven't really showed him, right? They haven't showed I, him in I this season okay, yet. I, was, I thought maybe I missed it in the couple uh-huh. slow episodes because I haven't seen him. Does but anyone now know? it's getting good because... Uh, Ra- Ra- Rachel watches it, so maybe Rachel... Rachel, Rachel what know? happened to the driver? And what was his name? She said she's almost <laughs> caught up. So. Oh, okay. Uh, we watched Game of Thrones and not everybody and not everyone was happy. I don't, oh, Rachel. I don't know. I don't. I don't know about that I, argument because I love me some Game of Thrones, and I, I didn't, it wasn't every episode. I did not feel like is that his name? I was Chicago. Being violated oh, he went to Chicago as a woman. Would she say Chicago? Oh. Maybe she's saying he went to Chicago. Yeah, yeah. I don't oh, remember what happened to him. His name is Chicago. He but I thought Chicago. he. Well, he helped her. So she she got pregnant by well. Also, the guy she was with, so the family she was with and had to be their handmaid, they, the guy was infertile, so he wasn't getting her pregnant. So they set her mm-hmm. up mm-hmm. with the driver, who's the real daddy, and he got her pregnant. And they were kind of in love, though. They were. He's they were her dad? Love. Oh, he was sent to the front lines in Chicago. Yeah. So the driver of this family, of I'm the family that the handmaid family that were trying to get her pregnant, got her pregnant. But the wife set it up because she knew her husband was infertile. <gasps> oh, yeah. The wife set it up. She knew her husband was infertile. She's like, you go meet him. The wife set it up. She, she got pregnant. Then it went to this whole thing. She was pregnant, blah, blah, blah. She had the baby. But then they helped her escape and mm-hmm. bring the baby to, like, safe land in Canada, right? Oh, my but, Lord. And he helped her. And the, and the wife helped her, too. Like, she got her fingers cut off or something, right? Didn't so, she? yep, she lost a finger. Yeah. But she the got, wife, you start to like the wife a little. You start little. to like, I but. I you hate her. But, Sarah, wait, wait till you cut up. Like wait till you ha- cut up, because you're going to start hating her again. I you're going to start hating her again. <laughs> oh, Lord. But, so, um, Elizabeth Moss's character doesn't leave. She has the she chance to go back. to Canada with her new baby, but she has a daughter. She has a daughter who's stuck there yeah. that someone else has adopted another family, so she doesn't leave, and that's where season three starts. She wants to like, come she has back a chance to her escape other daughter. To Canada. I don't know. And it was the so, other see, you daughter. You guys would like that. You have daughters. You would never be able to leave your daughter. Yeah, but I, I also wouldn't want my daughter to be like 
you know, having to get impregnated she, by yeah. people. Well, that's, why like to, that's why she went back to. That's why. That's why she went back. That's why she went back to try to get her. Maybe I don't know. But I'm telling you, Tommy's here, and I think so many people. So many people probably feel it now because, too, that they relate that to things that are happening in the world now when they're coming up with all these laws for women and all that kind of stuff. So they're like, look at the hands made tail for me. I I feel like we can get there. I don't want to get there. So I don't want to. The fact that this seems more and more likely of like a random thing to happen will make it much worse. (laughs) Oh, my gosh. So funny. (laughs) I don't know. But, I got to um, get caught up and see. I'm not going to like her again, though. So now <laughs> I know that. Sarah. Maybe I'll give season one a, a try. I don't know. But yeah, I'll, do it. I, I will put it at the bottom of the list. And the, uh, do trust me, do I was it. like, I'm never watching that show. <laughs> it just and sounds so stressful. It. Like, I got enough sh- regular stress. Yeah. I don't need stress from a show that just sounds very similar to what's actually going on in the right. world. That's- <laughs> That makes it scarier. <laughs> I don't know. I, I still know. Westworld. I'm still like I could be an android. I don't know. What's going on. <laughs> oh, oh, yes. gosh. <laughs> I mean, there's so many shows because Westworld. Don't even get me started on Westworld. I know. I literally like the whole first episode or first season. I was like, am I like a- right? <laughs> like, <it's, laughs> am I a real person? Like, oh, what? what? I still, mean? I still think I'm in the Matrix. I like that. <laughs> I really don't know what show you guys are talking about. Oh, Westworld, Westworld. is on HBO. Yeah. It's so, so good. Okay. On uh, HBO. Watch, Sarah. That's good. You would like that, I think. It okay. gets a little weird. Like, it and they got come a out weird. They're coming out it, with a movie now, yeah. though, right? They're coming out with the Westworld movie, I think, on HBO, aren't they? Are they? I don't think it's. No, Dead, Deadwood movie. Oh, Dead, maybe that's that, it. That was maybe show, that's it. And then they yeah. made a movie. Yeah. Maybe that. yeah um, but Westworld is like, now that's another weirdo, <laughs> but awesome show. It is Be- good. It is pretty weird. It's, 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 it drives me nuts, but, but it's so good. But Tessa, you're, you're watching a weirdo show, you said. What's yeah, the weird so- show that's like Black Mirror? <laughs> so yes, it's called that. Electric Dreams. We stumbled across it like last night or the night before, and I think it's. It's on like the Amazon, right? And we were just looking at what should we watch, what should we watch? And I started looking at that and we realized it was standalone episodes like Black Mirror. So I was like, oh, I can definitely, those I like because I feel like, you know, you don't have to get, you guys know, because you watch Black Mirror and stuff. It's like, you don't have to get totally invested. You can watch it and then I could wait like two weeks and watch the next one and it's totally not related, you know? Right. And we've only watched the first two episodes, but it's really good. It's, um, it's actually Philip K. Dick. He's an author you know who he is <laughs> and these are based on his uh stories and the first one is like really weird now my husband's read a lot of his stories before so he kind of was like oh I think I know this one I haven't read any of it but he's like obsessed with him and Chuck Palahniuk are like his two favorite authors mm-hmm. um and he was so that's why he was really interested in watching it and I it was just so, it's very weird but it's very like black mirror like technology these people had things they put on their heads, like the girl was having a hard time and her wife was like, let me get you this thing and give you a vacation. And she's like, okay, what's a vacation? And they said, well, you put this on and you go to a whole different life that's based off your mind and memories. And then you can't really tell which one's real and which one's the vacation, you know what I mean? And they go back and forth, it's crazy. It's crazy, but it's very Black Mirror. They have exactly a little circle thing that they put on their head and press the oh, button, boy. you know? And, and you know so what? I, Episode one of season five it black sounds Bears. it That's sounds like, like it but, sounds like people <laughs> it sounds like people are gonna petition netflix to get this canceled <laughs> I know, <laughs> that's what this serious. sounds like i was like i was hoping for more of a twist at the end though because i'm used to that with black mary you know, yeah and, stuff. and it was not as big of a twist as i thought we were gonna get uh but you know it's what very good they're all standalone. It's on the Amazon uh, Prime video. Oh, it is on Amazon Prime. Yeah. Amazon Prime is like, they're coming up. Like, I yeah, feel like I keep finding really good stuff over there. I mean, Good Omens, we're still in the middle of Good yes. Omens. So, which is awesome. If y'all good. haven't started it, please start. After that whole hoopla was getting it canceled, you really should watch the show. <laughs> yes, so you can see why these people are insane and, and pretty they're dumb yeah. to, send, to put up this petition. But anyway, it's a good show. I love Good Omens. And like, I don't know Amazon Prime. I feel like they're they're on the come up. I they're kinda, trying. I'm enjoying. Oh, they're trying. You guys have convinced me yes, to get it. Joyce, I don't need to watch it. it. I know you like oh, Black Mirror, so you yeah, like 
So, yeah. Sarah, you need to get it just for that marvelous ma- Maisel. What is it yeah, called? Maisel. Yeah. yeah. Maisel. I've watched so yeah. many. I do the Hulu, Netflix. Mm-hmm. That's all I do really right now. Yeah. Well, if you have Amazon Prime, like if you have it, like for real, like to get your packages, you might as well just. You don't even have well, it for your packages? Girl, what you? You don't have Amazon Prime. Look, this this is, is the Sarah. first person I've never, I've seen I never had Amazon Prime. People are constantly ordering. <laughs> like I was a, um, what's the lady that cleaned out? Like I did, I had one. Oh, of Marie Kondo. I was, a, yeah. yep, I did that. And I have purge, purge, purge. And was like. No, Sarah, mm, this no is how I am. Right I'm like, oh, look, I'm like, oh, my pen ran out of ink. Let me go order one on Amazon Prime. <laughs> That's how I <laughs> I'm like, I cleaned up and I'm like, my pen ran out of ink. Oh, I have 500. I forgot. I know, yeah. yeah. You probably Every- have like a million from conferences. And- <laughs> yes. Yeah. I probably have a Dumbo pen right now in the I know. Now you have a Dumbo pen. Oh, Janita, my God. I agree. Oh, Hi, Janita. Hey, Janita. Oh, so good. Yes. I've watched the series a few times. Yeah. Oh, a few times. Nice. I liked it, and oh, I tell you, I like if you can rewatch it. I yeah, like the I, guy. I rewatch it now that I know how things. I love to how, do that. How it went? Yeah, yeah. I'm curious because the mm-hmm. guys and even the actors in it. You're probably the only one for some reason. I think you might have watched this, which I did not watch it, but I kept hearing about it. Mm-hmm. The Hills reboot. Oh, oh I haven't. No, I watched I haven't. it. I haven't watched it. I haven't. Did you watch I it? I watched it. I, I heard it was on. Like, wait, you watched it, Amira? Of course. <laughs> oh, I'm a reality show junkie. I mean, we never talk about reality shows on here, but like but that could got... be a whole nother segment. I could do a segment every week about a reality Amira, show. Amira. Well, okay, speaking so of reality, much. what starts tonight, Amira, you got to watch it. I know Amanda watches it. Big Brother! Big Brother! Oh. <laughs> I don't know about that. You don't watch uh, Big Brother? I don't. I, I watch it me. from time to time, but it is a commitment. It's like three it times is. a week. It is. It is I'm like excited, though. It me is. and my daughter... Uh, are having a watch party. We got snacks planned out for some Big Brother. Oh, it's going to be a thing up in our house tonight. We are Big Brother out up in here. So my oh daughter my loves God. it. I need, Amira, I'm going back to this because I need okay. to know yes. what was it like. Was it good? Is Maureen on it? Oh, exactly. no, it was, who's no, on it? it wasn't good. Um, Audrina was on it. Brody was on it. Who else was on there? Like, it was awful to tell you. Oh, like, it was so boring. Okay. I'm like, but, but I, you know, we have to give them a chance. They're, they're not, remember, they're, this is new to them again. So is Whitney on it? Like, who is, is anyone Was Whitney on there? I don't, I don't remember if Whitney was on there. Lauren's not, Elsie's not on there. Wasn't it? And she's like the show. She is the show. (laughs) I know. That's what I was like. This this is is the thing now. Wasn't it boring in the first place? <laughs> no, it is not. How dare you? I watched it back then, okay? Yeah, the Hills was pre-Kardashians, okay? So, like, that was our drama back then. Like, oh, my God, I can't even believe that she bought him to the party. Like, we're going Or out. she didn't go to Paris for him. And she didn't go to Paris for a boyfriend that she broke up with. Ah, this is horrible. I would never do that. And they lived in, like, a $3 million be- dollar oh, beach Oh, Joyce, house Joyce said Whitney is on there. She said Whitney was on oh, there. Oh, was she okay. on there? Mm-hmm. And Joyce said well, she loved it, so maybe I'll give it a watch. I, I didn't watch Joyce. the beginning. How did you like that, Joyce? Help me. Tell me what was the best part. <laughs> I just I'm so bored. We I'm should so have bored. next week. Next week, all reality because we'll have Big Brother to oh, talk about. Gosh. We can talk about more <gasps> that. Amanda. Finally? Amanda, you're you're getting me really like excited. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna sure to at least watch one Big Brother before that. See, yeah, and yeah, Renee, we got look, three Renee, watch. I watch every season of Big Brother, even from when Chicken George and all them up in the in the first one. Oh, so. I love Big Brother. Yeah. I can't. We I just, should. I don't know. That's y'all thing. Y'all will have oh, to. I love it. No, I like yeah. it. I just don't like having to get on every night. Like, I like three, watching three it nights later. later yeah. It is a I commitment. Can just watch them one after the mm-hmm. other on the Yeah, that's a lot. App. It is a yeah. commitment. And y'all know I'm a binger. So that's how I really yeah. watch my reality shows. I try mm-hmm. to catch them when they come on on that night. But for the most part, I just binge them. I binge all the housewives. I binge uh, Below Deck Mediterranean. I was- Below deck. Uh, I just watched that last night. Oh I was just God, gonna I say, love it. I it's love so, that show. It's so <laughs> ratchet and it's luxurious. So... <laughs> Jonita oh, said too. She, you Jonita. See, they're gonna have a. They're gonna. Have I like a, how... a marathon of all the craziest. Uh, guests. Uh, uh, yes, and I'm they still, are. Uh, that girl uh, that like slept up on the top, and they were gonna throw the hose on her. I was like, uh, oh, this is the best. 
Okay. Oh, Rachel says Real Housewives. Yes, girl. Yes, girl, Rachel. Yes. See, Real Housewives. We need, we need a reality okay, show so segment. We're we gonna do. do that. Next next week we will do a reality show segment mm-hmm. just for you guys. We're gonna talk yeah. about all of our favorite reality shows that are on right now or even in the past. We'll even well, take it yep. there. I, I just heard reality shows. I just heard but, recent recent news is that new Lindsay Lohan show got canceled. Did y'all hear yes. that? Oh, I haven't even watched yeah. it. Yeah, well, I watched a little bit of it, but they it, were like... I didn't, Lindsay Lohan had the reality show? She does, and it was kind of like Vanderpump Rules, sort of, mm-hmm. but Lindsay Lohan, because oh, she I had like, like a club... But it's Lindsay Lohan, so it's kind but of. But they boring. were saying too, there was not. A, they were like, it was canceled because it was boring, not enough drama. And she's like, I'm just over yeah. that part of my life. And I was like, nobody wants to watch just sober. Yeah, nobody, nobody wants to watch, watch no sober, drama. normal Lindsay Lohan. Right. <laughs> no, nobody wants to do that. Amira, no. I know we just have like a minute left, but I want to yes. know what Real Housewives is the best because. Oh all my gosh! Okay, how dare you much. ask me such a question? I need to know. That's I like being a favorite child. Like I think. A zillion. Okay. I, well. Uh, Atlanta, you have to watch. Oh, yes. So I uh, usually that's the that's Nini? the answer that everybody will get. Nini? Nini is a hot mess, <laughs> but they're all hot messes. And the shadiness of it, like there's there's fighting, yes, but they're just the jokes that they say about each other makes you laugh. It's just like how did they come up with these like ridiculous things to say about each other? And then they're nice to each other again, and then they're so fabulous, and then they go on fabulous trips, and then they act horribly on the trips. So Atlanta's <laughs> probably number one. I love Orange Jersey. County is the only one I've seen oh, with Orange County Tamara and them, right? Isn't that yeah. Orange County? Yeah, Orange County's the original. But I like Jersey because I'm from Jersey. Mm. So I just, I, it's there. You can't pick. You can't just pick like a favorite <laughs> favorite. If you're gonna start, start with Atlanta because it'll keep you highly entertained every single episode. That's what I, I will say. Joyce Real quick for Sean, he's over on because I did a watch party. Oh, over they're all staying in Atlanta. Oh, yeah. So I see his comment. He's saying the new season of Legion started last night. Did I see it? it? Did. I did not watch it yet. I oh, did not watch it yet but... because it was, didn't start till 10 o'clock. And so I, and I have to wait for my husband. So we'll watch that tonight before Big Brother. Speaking yeah. of but that though. John, speak, I hope you enjoyed it. Oh speaking my Speaking of that, I just started season one. I you just did? started you season did? one. Yeah. It's so good. It's, it's so crazy. Good. He's like, I he's got those powers and you think he's my he... favorite mutant. Ever. He's so I like insanely it. powerful. Y'all, he's trying I like to save it. your son. Like, you need to read. I should put together a list of comics that you need mm-hmm. to read to, like, really get to know Legion because he's amazing. Mm-hmm. And so, yeah, Sean, I have not seen that yet, but I'm watching it tonight. And I, yeah. Have, so, what season is the new one? It. Three? This is this three, and it's going to be the final. And it's the last one. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I got, I got, you got to watch it and catch up. Yeah. (sighs) But yeah, Tessa, you should totally write that post because I I know you probably haven't yet. I'm going to write it on my list right now. Do it. Do it. Look at you. Do it. I'm going to. What about you, Amira? What have you been watching? I know Downton Uh, Abbey. Yeah, I was about to say, y'all don't need me to talk this this episode (laughs) because I'm going to tell you to go watch Downton Abbey. You're running out of time. The movie comes out September 20th. You need to go watch it. I watched it in 24 days. I'm writing a post about that, actually, how to watch it in 24 days. There you go. There's a science to it. There's a a science to it. I need to get caught up before the movie, so... Yes. So this, I will. Have any of you watched Black Summer though? Because I feel like Amanda, oh. didn't you kind of talk about that at one point? Black United. Summer. There was a trailer no. for it, so you don't remember. Mm-hmm. I'm sure it's a zombie one. Oh no! It's on Netflix. It's good. We just been Black, Black in like Summer. Space. I have so- to. I have to add that to my queue. I told you and what, then I, what I. My think. other one is. Um, go ahead. Oh, Amanda. I was just gonna Sorry. say my other one that I was trying to tell Tessa that she should watch. It just came on HBO. Oh, yeah. It's called Euphoria, <gasps> and. It oh. has that girl. Well, it's crazy. It's about this girl and she's on drugs. Yeah. It's like a crazy one. But it has that Storm Reed from A Wrinkle in Time in it. And that's what I was like, oh, she's in this. And I'm telling it's going to be one everybody's talking about. I'm just saying. Okay. And it, that's new? It scarred me. I've yeah, seen it's new. the commercials for it. It scarred me. I watched it. the first one it's crazy. and I knew the second one was on. I couldn't watch the second one because that first really? one was like. Amira. It just it broke my heart. I can't watch that type of stuff. Amira. I can't. Did you see it? Well, don't end? give anything away. Did you see? All right, I won't give too much. But did uh, you see? First yeah, one? don't give. At the very end scene of the first one, I had to rewind it three times. Do you know why? Why? Don't tell us. Don't I tell don't us. No, it won't be a spoiler. Us. It won't be a spoiler. I know it won't. Are you kidding? Because this there's a, a they were laying a her new friend, right? Her new friend and her are laying on the bed. She oh made wait, 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 wait. Yes. Okay. And she's got a bulge. <laughs> She got a bulge. She got a bulge. Yeah, that 
doesn't give anything away, you guys. Okay. But it's a it's an intense show. So if you're going yeah. to watch that one, that's like real time. Just like uh, Big Little Lies is real. It comes yeah. on right after Big Little Lies. It does. It does. Okay. So you could just watch it all together. But it's like going from Big Little Lies to Euphoria. You really like you need to take Monday off. Yeah. Like it's very. Yeah. It's I very intense. Would, I'm you not would like it, Tessa. Lies. I've only watched the first episode of this season. <gasps> what? what? Okay, we gotta go. Know. We gotta go. We can't. We won't have. We gotta do a Big Little Lies show because <laughs> we'll Tanya's read the book, week. which is good. So we could talk about the book and the show. Okay. Yeah. When time we'll is back. Next, when we'll time do it is next back. time. We'll do it next time. But okay. thank you guys so much for joining yes. us. This was fun. We gotta talk this about shows fun. more often. Yeah. So hopefully we gave you guys some ideas of shows to binge or start binging for the summer. Next week. I guess, according to Amanda, we'll be talking about reality shows. <laughs> Big so Brother, baby. Next week, our last, our last. That's going to be our last. For the season. Yes, our, our season finale will be about reality shows. Yeah, how <laughs> amazing okay. is that going to be? I love it. a little it. bit of Spider-Man, right? Oh. I'm, I'm going to see it. A I'm going to see it on Wednesday. I'm going to see it tomorrow, <laughs> too. I'm going to see it tomorrow, too. Okay. Me, okay. too. So we will see you guys okay. again. Next week, 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. And as always, my friends, stay off! Stay. Stay.